Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, hi, my name is Nini. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I just want to share with you two items that I recently scored from my MS essay and oh my god they are both are beautiful and one of them is actually my dream combo and I was able to score it through my essay my essay not too long ago but I have been using it quite a lot uh, for work actually I am so in love with this bag for work first of all it looks like a Kelly and the size 31 <sighs> next to my size 32 is look like almost the same size it's just this bag is a teeny bit taller I think and also this is in the cellular structures instead of the retone and that's why I like it so much better um, I don't like the retone style it doesn't work for me so that's why I have sold my uh, herb bags a very long time ago one of my first herb bag is in the retone style but the color is very unique colors and it's absolutely beautiful I just wish that I have that bag in the cellular structure but now I am so happy that this is in the cellular structure and you see this is the treated canvas so it's been coated with something so it won't get dirty. I think it is waterproof that's what my essay told me. So if something happened to it I just have to wipe it off and it will be clean clean clean. So I am so happy because I am not a careful person so sometimes carrying the canvas bag is scare me a little and I have heard about people who have spilled drinks on their airbag and yeah lucky me I got this bag instead and oh my god I'm so happy seriously. So this is in the back of the bag so they have uh, the lock that come with this and also this zipper pocket. I have been using it quite a lot. Um, I put my keys, my credit card, and also um, uh, what else do I need? Something that I need to have access to, like, to really quickly. Uh, my phone is actually fit all that and it is really spacious in here. So the zipper packet is make all the different. Without this, I don't think I would be that comfortable using this bag uh why because this is very hard to get in and out of and i have been mentioned about this over all of my hair bag videos but it's the truth okay it's very hard to get in and out of this bag but i just love it so much because it looks like a kelly it's not something that's super boring um, it is definitely something that when people see it, they were like, wow, that's a, that's really nice. That looks so good and things like that. So I have tons and tons of com compliments uh, when I carry this bag. So this is inside. Um, I have an insert in it already. Um, so this is the removable pouch that came with the bag. And inside, I am using my uh, Birkin 30 insert that I have for my Birkin, but I decided to use it on the ear bag and it fit perfectly. And also because of the insert, so this bag is really structured now. Um, it's not going to fall over and it's going to sit flat when I put it on the ground and also it holds the shape of the bag really, really good. So I am really happy that I was able to use the Birkin 30 insert for this bag. I don't have to order an extra one. So the inside is quite simple. Let me take the insert. 
Desert Owl. Um, it's really simple. No other compartment or anything. They only came with a removable pouch. And the inside lining is, they call it egg crew, I believe. So the inside is matching with the zipper pocket. And that is so perfect. The only thing I don't like about this bag is the strap. Um, so I have the strap removed from the bag and I am not using it at all. I don't like how the strap is so stiff and long. I consider putting on um, different type of strap if I need the strap options. But at the same time, I am a tough handle girl. And this is really big and it's very easy for me to carry like this. So I could be hand free. And lay I say, I could throw this back up and down and all over the place and not even care for it to get dirty or scratchy. So I am super happy. The only part that is very easy to get scratched up is actually this uh, leather piece up here. So it's made from natural leather and to be honest, I have only used this bag for over a month. There are have tons of scratch it on it already but because it's in a black color so it's not that obvious but if if i show you closer you see how they have tons and tons of scratch it on it already at this point it doesn't even bother me anymore because i still love it and <laughs> it's just looking so cool and unique and also the top handle is very comfortable to carry. It doesn't hurt. It doesn't cut into your skin and it's very steady. I love it. Okay, go back to the getting in and out of this bag. It's not very easy to close it all the way. So normally I would just put it in like this and I will hook this strap over and I just let it flap open like this most of the time because this would be way easier for me to get in, in and out of the bag instead of trying my best to close with the leather piece on. It's quite a struggle to close it up all the way because this natural leather is very stiff and it is super hard to, to close, <laughs> to be honest. So I can just close it and I like close it up like this and Voila. So this is how normally I would carry this bag by closing it just halfway. And if you decide to go for an airbag, use an insert because it makes all the difference that you ever need. You need it. Another thing I want to mention is this right here is a screw. But you could like take it off if you want to add a different strap or if you want to, um, you know, put the old strap on, take the old strap off. You can also take the top handle off and put on a different type of top handle. So it's, you can take this off right here so it's come apart. And then you can just take this out and then put it back. So it's very easy. It's very easy to be removed and put back. Um, so whenever you take this off, and you could totally take the the top part of the the leather piece off, and somebody even showed me how to flip this back inside out. So it's making a different style of the back. But to be honest, I don't want that. I just like the cellular structure and I like the black color but if I want to change you know to a different look I totally could so I also like that option for the earth bag so let me show you my everyday style that how I go to work with this bag
love the cellia structures. I love how much that it looked like a Kelly bag. So it's not a boring bag. It just spiked up my work look and I love carry it. Also, I love the option of removing the strap that came with it and I could play around. I could put, like, put different strap on it and it would look absolutely beautiful the way I want it to be. And I also love the zipper pocket in the back um, that I could get easy access to some of the things that I need. You know, it's very handy. Um, on the other hand, so I've been using this bag for over a month now and I have noticed that the leathers has become softer over time so it would be very um maybe it would be easier to close and open in the future when it have softened over the time. Um, and on the other hand, um, because they are treated canvas, so it is waterproof and to me <laughs> that is really, really important because I can totally beat in this back up and it's still going to look absolutely perfect. So I also think that her bag is a very good uh, handbag to purchase from MS because of the price point. It's uh, only $2,575. Um, this one is much more expensive than the regular canvas style. And also I love Urbag because they came out with a lot of colors. You know how Elmas play with their colors. So in the future, I do want to own more Urbag into my collection. If I could add more, I would be so happy for it. Um, but on the other hand, I totally just like the airbag and the stalia structure so i am not gonna settle for the red tone and also i like it to be one color top and bottom so i saw a lot of different versions of the airbag but in the end i only like the one color so this is something it's kind of fun if i want to go on a hunt for it so i will totally share with you guys all of my airbag purchase in the future because this is not the first one I purchased and this won't be the last one. Thank you so much for watching the video today and if you like my video please consider to hit like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will hope to see you guys back again in my next video. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye bye.